will be there. I read that this was actually filmed in Texas. Is that true? It is filmed in Austin. Yeah, like all my family films. Yeah. I love that. I love. I just wanted to get the confirmation from the man uh, himself. You know, this is something that uh, you brought us, I think, that can inspire us, especially in this time right now. Uh, I want to get your thoughts on how we can draw inspiration from this film. Well, the movie's designed to inspire families to, you know, work together, partner together, not just parent and be parented, but partner together to help mentor the next generation that has to come save the planet because obviously the adults screw the whole thing up. And uh, that's really the message of the movie that they've got to get there sooner and faster and they need parents to be better role models and to not see this is me telling you, but this is me partnering with you um, and believing in their abilities and helping them harness their power and find their power and that's why I kind of made the, the lead girl who had no special powers, the one that change makes the biggest difference to show that just anyone can go make a great change if they have their heart and their mind in the right place. So that was a very necessary message done in a fun way. It's entertaining. Kids watch these movies over and over. It's good food for thought. Um, but that was the mission of the movie. It felt really needed when I wrote it two years ago. And now it seems even more needed because it just get, things just keep getting worse. And we need that positivity. When we go back to the first film, uh, just a quick question on this one, uh, Shark Boy and Lava Girl, uh, you know, with these characters, is it true that your children actually inspired those characters? Yeah, I mean, a lot of the characters are inspired by them. In fact, my daughter inspired at least three of them. She, her nickname is Missy, she, her, um, is, since she was little. She also draws all the time on an iPad. So she's the one who gave me the idea for the girl who can draw the future. She also sings all the time. So that was another superpower. I mean, I just model them after my kids and then just separate all their little attributes out into different characters. But um, but yeah, very much so. And they're always making faces. She's the queen of making faces. So she's face maker. She's at least four of the characters, if not more. That's just one daughter and I've got four other sons. <laughs> they all inspire them, yeah. You, under, you understand now they're all going to be pitching you ideas nonstop. Oh, no, they worked on the movie. Oh, no, we came up with all the characters together. Yeah, they all worked on it. I love uh, that. My son was the composer. My other son was the editor. My other son was my um, producer. My other son designed the alien sets with his game engine at 15. I mean, they're really beyond us already. These kids are, the kids of today are just uh, not like we were. They're so much savvier. And that's the message of the movie, too. And that's really, really the reality in this world. Well, you should be really yeah. proud. I know that you're proud of the cast working with Pedro Pascal, who you've always wanted to work with, by the way. And I read that. I'm like, wow, for real. And what was that like? Tell me about it. It's incredible. You know, he's from also from San Antonio, like I am. And so we had that connection. He loved coming back to Texas. He hadn't been there since he was a kid. And uh, he loved the idea of this film. And um, we just always wanted to work together. And, and we got to really have a good time. I'm sure we'll work together again. In fact, my very next project was Mandalorian. There he was. So we're hopefully we just keep following each other around because he's, he's incredible. And he's, now he's having his day. I mean, he's everywhere right now. It's a good day to say